Howdy folks and welcome to each and every one of you in 1882 J.A. Roth published the lyrics to the great Rock Island route and uh, some of his lyrics were moved over to this next song which is called the Wabash Cannonball. William Kint, I don't know how to pronounce his name, K-I-N-D-T, and the famous Alvin Pleasant Carter of the Carter family uh, wrote the other lyrics, the modern lyrics to Wabash Cannonball, and uh, sang, A.P. Carter sang it, and uh, the, the one that I really like a lot is Roy Acuff, he recorded the Wabash Cannonball in 1936. And there's a video of a movie that he did in 1940 uh, singing this song. But he also did this terrific two-tone whistle, whistling, and he also made a noise in his throat at the same time. So a two-tone whistle. I'll, I'll try and uh, stick the link to that video in the description down below. Today I'm going to be playing my fry pan lap steel guitar and picking my old guitar and singing this tune. It's a pretty laid back version. Very slow like some of the trains that go across the street while you're trying to get to work or get back home again. Anyway, hope you enjoy the song. From the great Atlantic Ocean to the wide Pacific shore from the queen of the flowing mountains to the southlands by the shore she's mighty tall and handsome and known quite well by all she's a regular combination on the wabash cannonball listen to the jingle the rumble and the roar as she glides along the woodland Through the hills and by the shore Hear the mighty rush of the engine Hear the lonesome hobo's call You're traveling through the jungle On the Wabash Cannonball She came down from Birmingham On cold December day as she rolled into the station, you could hear all the people say, Now there's a gal from Tennessee, she's long and she's tall. She came down from Birmingham on the Wabash Cannonball. Our eastern states are dandy, so the people always say, from New York to St. Louis and Chicago by the way From the hills of Minnesota where the rippling waters fall No changes can be taken on the Wabash Cannonball Here's to Daddy Claxton, may his name forever stand and long to be remembered round the ports of Alabama. His earthly race is over and the curtains round him fall. We'll carry him home to Dixie on the Wabash Cannonball. Listen to the jingle, the rumble and the roar. As she glides along the woodland, through the hills and by the shore. Hear the mighty rush of the engine, hear the lonesome hobo's call. You're traveling through the jungle on the Wabash Cannonball. When I was a little 
kid growing up on a farm south of Benito. It was right up against the uh, Duck Mountains. I heard at school that the last steam train was going to be pulling through the little village of Benito that Saturday morning. So I rushed through my farm chores and hopped on my bike and scurried off into town and onto the railway station platform. Railway was the station was on the north side of the track and there was three grain elevators along the south side and the last steam train came through huffing and puffing they had a great sounding whistle. Anyway it was a long time ago, decades ago, but I still remember it fondly. Hope you enjoyed uh, watching and listening to the song. God bless and we'll see you down the road.